The next tool I'm going to show you is the manual input inside of the product search tool. So this one's actually pretty cool. Let's say, for example, you have a source of Etsy product links from some other method, maybe using another tool or some other way that you like to look at products um, on Etsy, or maybe you just copy them directly from Etsy. You may have your method, but this is where if you can just enter in your own links, they have to be um, Etsy product links. Etsy product links say Etsy.com, they say forward slash listing, and then you have a number after it. So that's what they look like. And once you put it in there, you can go ahead and extract the data, just like the other tools, and it'll go ahead and grab all that information for each and every product just like that. So it's pretty awesome. And of course, everything else that comes along with the other tools in here inside of the product search tool, you also get access to, like the file saving, preview, filters, all that kind of stuff. So this is how you use the manual product search. It's very, very simple and easy to use. If you get access to other links, just go ahead and plug them right in there.